Welcome to Enchanted Tarot. This is for the sign of Capricorn for the month of October or from whenever you view this video. When you view it, you were meant to hear the message. <clears throat> Keep in mind it is general. These messages are only for a specific few. What we see here um, is somebody who, you see, she's being burdened by um, by something, by her thoughts, most likely, because although she has this open book on her lap, um, she's unable to concentrate on it. Um, she's thinking of something else, something that's burdening her. This is you. This is Earth, so, or unless you are dealing with another Earth sign. Um, so she's thinking, she's maybe even fantasizing. Um, <clears throat> what she's thinking about is um, a meeting. Um, someone, I, I feel that she's waiting or thinking or wanting someone to come and explain. Uh, or come and apologize to her for something. She's definitely emotionally stuck here on whatever this situation is for her. I'm saying she because it's a female here, but it can be male or female. Um, something is out of balance, um, or what she's thinking about the other person may not be putting effort towards it or she's not yet putting effort towards making this um, a reality or making this meeting actually happen. She's got a lot of anxiety and stress and she wants to um, to be able to see clearly. She cannot see clearly uh, what was hidden from her. Um, or what is hidden from her at this time. She seems to be somebody without direction. Um, she may feel deceived by someone. Someone may have uh, crossed a boundary with her in the past. Um, and she was wishing for so much more from that relationship. Um, she could be wishing in her present state for this reconciliation, but it's like she's waiting on that other person to come forth. Um, again, wanting to be able to see clearly, wanting to come out of this um, isolation period, this pause, this break. Um, wanting her Ten of Cups um, or dreaming of this relationship moving together towards a common goal of having that equal balance. It's all these things she thinks about as she waits. The relationship struggled in the past. Um, and I feel like... Um, whatever happened, she's like feeling the fallout from that. This is what is burdening her. And she's wishing that, you know, wishing for that change. Um, there's no talking at this time. All these things go on within her. She's very distracted and is perhaps missing signs because of that. Because the answers for her lie in the past, but she may not be seeing them. Um, she can be very much um, uh, emotionally distracted. She is either wanting this uh, to take a risk on this person um, or is hoping that they 
will take a risk on her. I mean, it can go either way, these energies. They're general. So someone did cross a boundary and she felt or is feeling like a fool here. What is unexpected about this situation is there is a return of that person. Um, this pause or break will soon be over. Um, she will be getting the answer or clarity that she is seeking. Again, you know, um, she needs to, um, to get herself grounded because she's clearly not grounded, which typically she would be being the queen of, uh, of coins. Um, so this person's coming back. There is going to be a meeting, a discussion. But we do have the Harlequin here and the card of deliverance with the deception above it. So I feel as though she may not quite be trusting what this person is going to tell her. Um, either she may suspect them of... Um, not being honest, or she could be keeping her own feelings hidden at this meeting. Um, she is wondering um, if they can actually go back to the place that did offer um, love, comfort, and support. She's unsure. <laughs> so I feel that she will suspect deception here at this, or that the person might be being deceptive. She does not want to um, be the fool again. So the question for her is, does she want to take this risk or not? Because there is some sort of um, discussion, negotiation that will take place here. So the unexpected is the return. It is the conversation, um, the discussion. This a card also um, asks her to remove the blindfold. And we also have, yeah, you see, the Page of Wands and the Ace of Wands, but the Ace of Wands she does not yet hold. Um, trying to read the signs, and they all make sense with what I'm seeing here. So the opportunity, opportunity does um, present itself again for this new beginning, but can it work? Is the other person telling me the truth? Can it grow? Yeah. Can we close this distance between us? And you will, you will be very tempted by this offer. But I must warn you that there is a possibility of deception here. I 
I thank you for watching, for liking and sharing my videos, and for subscribing. Many blessings.